Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be showing you what I made in the month of July, 2023. So let's get started. I'm going to have two categories. One for unfinished projects, cause let's be honest, everyone has plenty of those and finished projects. I also just wanna mention that I was traveling for the most part of this month and that it was my mom and younger sister's birthday this month so just keep that into consideration when i show you how much i made because it does not feel like i've made as much as i would have normally have i'm gonna show you the unfinished projects first and then i'll show you the finished projects afterwards so yeah unfinished leggy frog i have to add the must sew it closed on the bottom. I have all the parts made, you know, and it's just not finished yet. That money is my pattern, and that luggy froggy pattern is also my pattern. Is this like square teal frog that I haven't added the face on to? Here, let me let me give you the creator. The person that made this pattern is small berry studio i did add something to this pattern um i made the arms first so i can just crochet the arms into the frog so it's one less two less things actually to crochet just so so yeah this cow it is like i i actually started like three of these and i only think i finished one like my car project you know so the, the frog pattern that I showed you, that teal one, I started a pink one, and I didn't finish the top. Leggy flower, I started another one of those, but I messed up on the petals. I made them thinner, and I accidentally did that. This one's basically finished, I just have to add a face, but it's like a lavender sleep buddy, so it has a sewed pouch in the middle. Can you hear it? um with rice and lavender buds dried and it smells so good and if you squish it it smells even better um but uh that is it that is it for the unfinished projects so let's get on to the finished projects of this video i made four of them Dark green, purple, raspberry, pastel orange. Ochi the cow pattern. I saw that and I was like, I want to try to make a similar thing, but no so. And yeah, this chubby frog. This is my pattern. I actually made this pattern like a year ago and I wanted to write it down. So I made another one. Clearly my tension has changed because let me show you the first one. This is the first one I made. I used the same size crochet hook. I actually changed the size of eyes, um, but I tried it with a nine millimeter and they just looked wrong. So yeah, I made this like little, wor and, um, I made this little no sew bunny in worsted weight yarn and I was like, I don't know how much I like it. I might try it in velvet, you know? See how I liked it. Um, I made it in velvet and it's so cute. Here, let me give you a close up. Here's the first one in white. When I made, it's in just chenille from like the Dollar Tree in, in the color lavender and the color blue in just chenille. The first leggy flower, I actually posted a YouTube short about this guy. Um, I think it's so cute and I love it. So yeah, this blue cow, this is actually the finished cows. I showed you the other two, they are unfinished. I don't know why this nose looks so crooked, but it's not like it's on straight. Um, but yeah, this is white but not blanket and then blue just chenille and pink just chenille. frog coasters because I got these new like two things from Dollar Tree the for desk organizing I was like I need something to put my 
cups on because I always have a little drink with me when I'm sitting at my desk or just doing anything. I always have like a little drink and I needed a coaster and I love frogs. So I have made a frog coaster. Well, two, because I couldn't just have one. I made two of these. Well, not the same colors. The second one was purple and mustard, um, but that got bought when I was on vacation. Um, I was kind of, I normally don't sell my things because I have a show in September that I'm trying to prep for and it's like a pretty big show. And I've never done a market by myself. I mean, I've done markets before, but with someone else. I like boothed with someone else and I only got like the end of a table. So I'm doing one by myself and I have to have a lot. So I've just been prepping and I let him buy one because I was traveling. Less to take home with me, right? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I made two no sew oxalotls. This is my pattern. Cloud. I was just messing around with yellow yarn and I somehow made a cloud. But yeah, it's worsted weight. Low sew baby cow. This is my pattern. The only thing you have to sew this whole project is the head onto the body. And this one is like galaxy themed because like the galaxy colored ho ho hooves, the galaxy spots, and like the dark blue like nose. It looks much darker on camera. It's like more like bite. But yeah. Let me know if you guys want me to release this pattern because I think I might, but like I also don't know. It has some more like adjustments I need to do to it, so yeah, but super cute. It's a baby cow. I mean, who can go wrong? What can you go wrong with like a baby cow? I, okay. I made these laying no so frogs. How cute are these? This is in Premier Parfait Chunky Mint, and I made one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I made eight of these, but one of them sold. The same guy bought them as the Oxalotl as earlier. Um, but yeah, there's seven of these, and I made eight. And yeah, how cute. They're so cute and squishy. Here are the mint ones. Well, they're light green, but the colorway is called mint. I made three strawberry themed ones. Um, just like added this little strawberry thing to the top. It's still no so. Two little ones. Thinking about making more little ones so that I have like a cheaper priced item, but I don't know. Three yellow leggy frogs, three purple leggy frogs, two, two blue leggy frogs, and one pink leggy frog. This is the only finished leggy frog. A mouse in the suitcase. Oh, so here it is. The mouse tail's hanging out a little bit. Oop, I have some yarn from traveling. Um but i actually came up with a name for her now that i realize youtube turns off my comments like come on youtube but i named her rosie the mouse she's so cute she's like my favorite project i've made i'm keeping this um here's rosie's robe her pillow and her blanket and then the suitcase itself has inner pockets, outer pockets. This like plastic stuff I've never used before, but it's super cool using it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you want, you can like, comment, and well, actually you can't comment because YouTube's gonna turn off my comments, but you can like and subscribe if you'd like. It'd be very much appreciated and have a nice day. Happy crocheting. <laughs>